Well, he is a classically trained chef from Australia who recently released his first U.S. book and opened his very first U.S. restaurant. Congratulations Thank on that. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me. Right here in our kitchen. And uh, also, his name of his restaurant is called uh, it's called Bondi Harvest. So welcome, Perfect. Chef Guy Turlin. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks Bondi, for having me. Is that a famous beach in Australia? It is a famous beach. One of the most beautiful beaches, um, I'd say, in Australia. Yeah, yes. it's stunning. So, and we're going to be making, well, I want to talk to you about sustainable fishing yes. first because you're going to be making a dish that has we fish are. in it. So they're going to be sustainable fish sliders. Oh, yeah. uh, and I know sustain, uh, so, uh, sustainable. doing sustainable yep. fish is really important it to you. It is important. So we want to know what and why you do this. So I have a connection with the ocean. I do a lot of free diving. I surf, um, and I think it's, un it's, it's really important to understand what's under there, you know, so I've got a connection with the ocean. So sustainable fishing and sustainable um, sort of ways of deciding which fish to choose is, you know, it's all about, you know, what is good for the environment. It's about, you know, leaving the ocean the way you found it um, because, you know, we want our kids to enjoy the ocean, we want our kids to enjoy fish, and, you know, we don't want to take all the fish out. So it's like, you know, throw a line in, catch one fish. Is good, right? You know, throw a massive net in, like a massive trawler. You take so take much everything, out. and you don't know a lot what of you're getting. Life, you know, right. you're taking turtles, dolphins, you know, oh. bio catch. You know, the stuff that you want to leave behind, the beautiful things that we want to enjoy. You know, yeah. so it's about um, you know the decisions we make. Do make to a being difference. responsible. Is there a list of fish that you can, uh, or an app you can go to to find there out is, what yes. you can buy, what is sustainable? Yeah, so I mean, what I have to say to guys, you, you should talk and work with your um, supermarkets and your fish suppliers and find out, you know, what is sustainable. Um, you know, there's plenty of um, websites out there you can search as well. So just, you know, do a bit of research. And what and about learn. restaurants? I mean, if you yeah. ask the chef or, or say, yeah. I want sustainable fish. Yes. Demand sustainable. Demand it, <laughs> demand it. Like I said, you know, what we demand in the end makes a massive difference. Mm -hmm. Can so we demand food now? Because you can I demand food. You can demand food. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Doesn't that look great? And you're using yeah. what fish today that's sustainable? We're just using a white fish. So, like, one of my favorite white fishes <laughs> that is sustainable is mahi-mahi. Mahi-mahi. <laughs> yeah, so it's one of the oh fastest growing God. fish in the sea. Mm -hmm. And it's, you know, it, it's perfect because it, it sort of redevelops and regrows really quickly, which yeah. means we're He's not already finished his mat. Well, that was one bite. That's impressive, not just a slider, but the way you've just named no, yeah. 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 It tastes like I'm back on Bondi Beach. There we oh, <laughs> Perfect I'm, accent. I'm trying to be cool. Yeah. Yeah. You are cool. So, cool. so the first step. Started, yes. we on the, this is the rub. This is a rub. So have a smell of that. I got you covered. How good does that smell? Oh, that's so lovely. It's really simple. You guys want to have a smell of that. It's so beautiful. So that's a spice mix on top. So Okay, can I be the masher? You can, yeah, you okay. can get rid of the frustrations in the, uh, in the mortar and pestle. Mm. So we've got some cardamom pod. Yes. We've got some coriander seed. Oh, my gosh. We've got some black yeah. pepper. Oh, this is so okay, what do you guys think? Good. Take the meat. All good? Yeah. Yeah. We've got so some good. oregano. Or, wow. Oh, wow. Is that oregano? Oregano. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oregano. We've right. got uh, some smoked paprika. <laughs> paprika. Some garlic powder. You should bottle this. Some chili. Chef, well, that's you know? what's so good. You can Sell make it. a big batch and you can leave it in your cup and you can use it for fish and meat and all sorts of things. Do you use it for meat too, you said? Yes. Okay. yes. It's so sorry, this is mahi mahi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's I love beautiful. Mahi -mahi. It's one of my, yeah, yeah. So yeah, good. Yeah. So we're going to take the. That's right. I'm going to grab that spice mix back wherever it is. You're going for I just need a pinch. I was dipping it in the French. <laughs> you can really, that's all you want. Take it home by all means. Sorry, we're dipping really the <laughs> French fries really in the sauce. Just go for it. I need this seasoning. Oh my god. It is so good. It's good. Wow. I'm gonna dip my. Fry I didn't realize you needed it back. Oh, over there. A little bit of olive oil, <laughs> and the fish is gonna go down. I'm going to go skin side first. And a trick with the fish when you put it on the pan is put There's a trick it to it. away <laughs> from yourself so that you're not splashing Splash. oil onto yourself. Right. You know, it's quite simple, but I know. I've made the mistake many a times. I have. Yeah. Well. What, what kind of oil is that? That's just uh, grapeseed oil. Grapeseed. Yeah. But at home, I like to use coconut oil. I do love coconut oil. Coconut okay. oil. Yeah, That's good yeah too. the flavor, it's a lot better for you as well. So. Yeah, you like it. You're putting more oh of the Oh, my God. Biggest main season. That's what I said. Make a big batch at home. Amazing. Okay, so next step. So your sauce that yeah. is not your traditional. No, I love I'm using it yogurt. You're using yogurt. Yeah, yeah. So it was a nice tang. A little bit, yeah, it's a beautiful tang, you know, lower in calories, um, and it's tasty, mm -hmm. which is the most important oh. thing. Um, and it's also probiotic. So again, you know, getting it's all healthy. So a lot of what I cook is the healthy food. So we've got some parsley, some yogurt, some coriander. It's all going to go in there. We've got some gherkins as well. Now let me ask you, is it Greek yogurt or is it just like regular This yogurt? is Greek yogurt, Greek so you yogurt. don't want sweet yogurt. You want, okay. you know, that tangy right. Greek yogurt. Okay. Some capers that are chopped up, mm. a little bit of Dijon, mm. and some lemon juice. I'll just multitask here. How long do you, the, the fish is rather thin, so how long do you cook that? Yeah, so that's going to take a sort of about a minute and a half, two minutes on each side, Ooh, so we're just going to flip already. that. Yeah, it doesn't take long. And remember with, you know, fresh, beautiful seafood, you don't need to overcook it. 
Right, because it's so that's about what you said two minutes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Really yeah. it either falls yeah. apart or it tastes like rubber. <laughs> it does. So that's our tartare sauce. It's super easy. You know, it's tangy. It's delicious. The sauce. But, it's, it's so light, but it's it's uh, refreshing. It is mm -hmm. right, and, yeah, it's, it's really and it's healthy for you too. Yeah. You know? What's what's the most? You don't have to go without. Where is this delicious. restaurant? Look at that. Ooh. Ooh. Very <laughs> <laughs> What, what's the most famous dish in your restaurant? What do people order the most? These actually fly out the door. So we do these not as a slider, but as like a whole sort of burger. And it's mm. they just go crazy. It really is a God. tower, though. It is. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's really satisfying. You, you ate your tower. I know, I ate my tower. Right? And it, it kind of blew up in, in, in my hands, which was I the saw best that. Way. I didn't say <laughs> I love it. So I just shoved it in. <laughs> Mm. What is that? Pickles? Pickled something? The slaw, the slaw is great. yeah. So oh, it's got slaw. pumpkin seeds, it's got apple and fennel and cabbage and mint and all oh sorts God. of things in is there. Is that so all again, in, the, in the cookbook? Yes, it's all in the cookbook. Oh, oh, yeah. Do we have to come to Australia for you to make this? No, we're in Santa Monica. We're just no, no, no. So good. Bang the door down. Do you have... cater? We do cater, yes. I'm having a party this weekend. Awesome. I'm here. Everyone's invited. Head to our website for this recipe.